Hi my lovelies, welcome to my channel and welcome to a brand new video. I hope you're all doing well and having a lovely day. My name's Amanda, if you're new here, today guys I have a charity shop haul for you, a thrift shop haul if you like to call it, if you're watching from the States. Now I've been into several different charity shops in my area, I picked up some really handy nifty storage solutions. So this video is really all about storage and these storage solutions, really at afford, <clears throat> sorry excuse me, oh my goodness, my voice Guys, I lost my voice over the weekend and I thought it was coming back. Well, it has come back, but it hasn't come back 100%. So I might struggle to bring you this video today. If I sound a little bit hoarse, this thing has just attacked my voice, you know. I was absolutely fine last Thursday. I attended my friend's wedding and it was such a lovely, beautiful day. The ceremony was so stunning. Um, yeah, and came out, went to the reception bit of the wedding and I couldn't talk my voice had gone my husband was saying to me what's happened to your voice and it just went like that you know so I don't know if it's a little bit of hay fever as well as just feeling a little bit run down this sore throat losing the voice and coughing has been going around for a little while now I do know a few people that have actually had it for a a number of weeks now you know and I'm just hoping that my one is not going to last that long so do forgive me guys if I do sound a little bit hoarse in this video it's because of this throat but I'm going to push for it okay so today's video is a charity shop haul a thrift shop haul I picked up some really nifty story solutions in my local charity shops that I can't wait to show you so I'm going to get straight into it because of my voice I'm just going to get straight into it no hanging around no did the dally in just going to get straight into it but before I do I'm going to have a sip of my iced coffee because I need coffee right now guys for me to get through this video with this throat I do need a bit of coffee as well yeah lovely iced coffee delicious delicious okay so the first item I'm going to show you, a little bit boring, but handy. Okay, guys, I picked up this Stanley Tool Organizer set. This was in the Salvation Army Charity Shop. Now, it's got all the little divider bits with it. It's in good condition, you know. I don't even know why someone would have just, I don't even know why someone would have just put this into the charity shop. Maybe because they've upgraded into a larger one or who knows, you know, but... I'm happy that they put it in there because I am in need of something like this for my own handy tools. I can put my little screwdriver in there, you know, my um, crosshead screwdriver or Phillips screwdriver, flathead screwdriver, you know, put a couple of fuses in there, all the things that I need for quick DIYs around the house. This came in, guys, at £2.50. And like I said, it is the brand Stanley. I just had to get it because it's in good condition, you know practically looks new now I did pick up another one which is downstairs I'm gonna go and get that in a minute um it's a smaller one and that one was actually a little bit cheaper but I'll show you that in a minute okay but yeah I just thought I'd show you that really nifty storage and of course you don't even have to use this for um DIY tools you know I can easily put um you know like some um what should I say some sewing needles and crafts you know crafts bits and bobs in there as well will be really handy so I thought it was a really good buy so yeah had to get that okay so the next item I picked up was this lovely crystal drinks decanter I think that's what you call it a decanter it's absolutely gorgeous now the only thing with this it never had the lid to go with it but I got it at a bargain price of £2.50 and I got this in Bernardo's charity shop now when I saw it I thought yep yeah, definitely have to pick this up I do have a decanter up in my loft that I'm not using um, only because I don't really like, like the style of it I'm going to swap out the lid for it and put it on this one and I think it's going to work really lovely so anytime I see these in the charity shop I do pick them up because I just find these are such classic pieces and absolutely gorgeous as well all that lovely cut glass so yeah real bargain for that one so the next item I picked up this is another storage um, basket this I picked up in the Salvation Army charity shop now as you can see guys it has seen a little bit of better days on the corner there but the rest of the basket itself is in really good condition now I'm going to use this under my 
um, TV stand, my entertainment unit. There's three sort of openings to put like baskets, to put bits and bobs in. Now I do already have something there already, but what that one is, it's a cutlery tray in this same design, but it doesn't really work under the TV stand. This is sort of more suited. You know, I can put like magazines in here and hide away some of Oakley's little toys in there. You know, so yeah, picked that up and that one was two pounds. And I thought it was really good price because I think in places like B&M Home Bargains, these go for at least six pounds. Now, as I said, it has got a little bit of damage on the corner there, but no one's gonna see that. It's just gonna be under my TV stand like that hidden away no one's going to see that bit so I, again I had to pick it up because I need it I really do need it you know like I said the cutlery tray one is just not working really and this is going to be a lot more suited so yeah had to pick that up so like I mentioned before I did actually pick up a smaller one of the Stanley organizers now this this haul I didn't pick up all these items in one shop you know in one day if I should say it was a few different days where I've been to the charity shop sorry I'm out of breath because I went downstairs to pick this up so this one came in at £1.50 it's very similar to the other one it's just smaller this one that I'm actually going to keep for myself I put one of my little blades in there already from Poundland and I'm going to add my other little bits and bobs in there as well. I'm going to add my other little bits in there as well. So I thought for £1.50, that's really good going. And again, it is the brand Stanley as well. So really good, strong organising toolkit there. Okay, so yeah. So this one's going to be for myself. I made a mistake earlier. That one's going to be for myself. And that one's going to be for hubby or just for the household. Okay, so that's those. So the next item I picked up, this has to be my favourite. This I found in the British Heart Foundation charity shop. And when I saw it, guys, I couldn't believe that someone would actually just put this in the charity shop. Now, it looks brand new, okay, but it's not brand new. And, you know, it could be brand new. Someone could have just purchased it, didn't want to use it, and have just popped it into the charity shop rather than return it back to the store. Now, I like to keep my receipts, like things like this, I keep my receipts, you know, and I'll return them back to the store. I'm really good at that, you know, I know a lot of people don't like to return things back to the store, but as long as you've got your receipt and it's within the 28 days or within the term to return it, I would return my items, guys. Yeah, I'll return it, get a, get a refund or an exchange, you know, I, I do like to return items if I'm not going to use them. Why have them in your house if you're not going to use them, you know? So this, I have seen it somewhere um, in a store for sale, but got it in the charity shop, guys, for three pounds for three pounds and this is a lovely wicker tray. I do absolutely love the design of this. It's like two tones, you've got that nice dark chocolate brown colour there and you've got that tan colour there. You know, I do have quite a few like trays, wicker trays and you know, some of them I haven't used yet. I am collecting these for a purpose, you know, because these always come in handy. So this is screaming out summer barbecue vibes, you know. I can have some canopies on here, bring it out for my guest, you know, or have some cool drinks on there, you know. This I had to pick up, three pounds in the British Heart Foundation charity shop. And I think that's absolutely gorgeous tray. Can you see guys, the detail on this? It's got two little handles on the side there as well. If you know where this is from, if you've got one of these, you know, do let me know in the comments because I know it's been busting my brains because I, I have seen it somewhere in the store on my travels, but not for three pounds, guys, you know? So yeah, that was a real bargain and that is my favourite so far from today's haul. Okay, so that's that. Okay, so the next item, um, I found these in the Salvation Army charity shop. Um, this is just a white basket, storage basket. Again, very handy, you know, I can put so much in this, you know, cleaning products and um, paperwork, you name it, hair products. It, the, the list is endless, toys, little Oakley's toys, or, you know, he's got like lots of um, like art, um, lots of pens and pencils and all that kind of thing. You know, this can be used for anything really. And I got this for one pound in the Salvation Army charity shop. It's a really good size, handles on both sides quite deep as well it can hold quite a lot so yeah so happy to find that and oops sorry I just knocked the tripod and then the next item I picked up was in the Sue Ryder charity shop and it's this beautiful glass ribbed jar 
How gorgeous is this, guys? It's got sugar embossed on it there. So I suppose there's a coffee and tea one to go with this or maybe biscuits. Now, I have seen this in Dunelm, okay? I picked this up in the Sue Rider charity shop and I got this for £1.50. I was so happy because I do, as you guys know, I do absolutely love glassed ribbed and this is so gorgeous and I do absolutely love the shape of it as well. It's in that square shape rather than the round, you know. So yeah, I have seen this in Dunelm but I got this in the Sue Rider charity shop for £1.50. So I don't think I'm going to use this for sugar. What I might do is just turn it around and use it to store my dishwasher tablets in. And I think this is going to look absolutely gorgeous in my under sink cupboard, which does need an update with a, a good declutter. So yeah, £1.50 for this. I'm going to leave that. No way was I going to leave this. So yeah, that's another one of my favourites from today's haul. I haven't even shown you everything yet. There's a couple of, there's, oh, there's three more items to show you. Wow. Okay, so the next item, which I picked up in the Cancer Research Charity Shop. Now, this is such, this was such a bargain. Now, it's not brand new. It's been used. And they were actually using it to put, like, kiddies' toys in. They actually had a sign on it to say, um, kiddies' toys, everything £1, everything, like, 2 for £1, 50p. Or, you know, some kind of deal on the, on the, on the box itself. But they're actually um, selling the box. Okay, as you can see guys, it is quite a huge storage box in very good condition as well. It also, it's also got a lid on it, a workable lid on it as well. It's very, very much, it's very huge. Now this is going to be perfect because you, we always need storage, we always need storage. I need to store some of my homeware bits away and I also need a box to put gifts in, you know, because I've been collecting little bits and bobs. And also from my hauls, guys, like I said, a lot of things I do return to the store and a lot of things I keep. Um, some of the things that I do keep, I like to sort of give away, like when a friend or a family member has a birthday, I can just jump in, get into my box, take out a candle, wrap it up, you know, something along those lines, you know. So yeah, I need a box just to put like a box for gifts. I don't know if any of you guys have that, but I do like to have like gifts sort of ready to go. You know, if you get like a last minute friend that's coming around, oh, I'm coming around, you know, I haven't seen you in ages and you want to just give them a nice little gift. I'm just going to my box and take out you know, take out a little token gift to give to them, you know? So that's why I picked this up. And also for the price, I got this guys for two pounds, two pounds. I mean, I've seen things like this in B&Q for nearly 20 pounds, you know, this kind of size basket or this size, this kind of size container. Yeah, 20 pounds I've seen these for, and it's really a good strong one. It hasn't got no faults in it or anything. It hasn't got no cracks or anything in there. It's perfect, you know. I'm giving it a wipe down already and this is going to be perfect um, for my gift box, okay? So that's that. Okay, so the next item I picked up, this was in the Sue Rider charity shop and all it is is a plastic tub. But these sort of things come in handy. I'm going to be using this for little Oakley. All these pens, you know, like I said before about that white basket, that might be used to put all these papers in, you know, and like, you know, papers and scissors and all that kind of thing. But this is absolutely perfect to put all his colouring pens in, you know, all the ones that he's been using recently because he's getting so much into his art and we've got so many, so many pens. So yeah, I've actually picked up two of these. There's another one downstairs and I've got this for just one pound. Okay, and it's really good, um, sturdy. You know what? I think I do actually have some of these already. These are ready. I'm sure I picked some of these up in a charity shop a little while ago and um, I'm using them in my kitchen under the kitchen sink to put my sponges in and so on. Yeah, these are so, so handy. So when you see things like this in the charity shop, guys, pick them up because they can be used as a plant pot or you can just use them for storage, okay? So the next item I picked up, guys, this is from the Salvation Army charity shop and it's this cloth or is it, what, what do you call this again? Is it a cloth? A cloth. Yeah, I think it's, it, yeah, <laughs> you know, I'll pick this up. Um, I'm I'm going to call it a cake cover, you know, because I do like this kind of thing. You know, I do have um, something very similar with, on my shelf in my living room at the minute, but I've got a candle in it. It's one of the taller ones. When I saw this, I thought this was so, so cute. You know, this came in at, I think I got this for £2. It's really thick, solid glass. 
Now what I thought I can use this for is to create like a little cheese board. And I don't know if you guys remembered from my last charity shop haul, I picked this up in one of the shops. I can't remember which shop it was. So I'm going to use this as a board for this and I'm going to put some cheese on there. So little Oakley's birthday is coming up. I'm going to have some cheese and crackers and that for the for the um, parents that are going to be dropping off their kids. Um, yeah, and little like finger food. So I thought this would be really handy just to put some cheese on there and I'm just going to cover it like that. How cool is this looking, guys? This is absolutely gorgeous, you know? So, yeah, so sometimes when you find things in the charity shop, guys, you know, it might not come as a complete set. I'm still after the glass tray, the, the oblong glass, the oblong glass tray for my butter dish. I'm still after that. I haven't found one yet, but I'm on the search for that. But what I'm trying to say, like, I picked this up, okay, in the charity shop, and I got this in my last charity shop haul, but these two go together quite well, you know? I'm so happy, you know? I was thinking, I wonder if this is gonna be the right size for this, because I never had this, of course, I never had this in my hand to sort of measure it up, and I think I gauged it quite well. So this is gonna look absolutely gorgeous on our side table with some, you know, cheese and little dips and stuff on there, okay? So that's my last item, guys, from today's haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. I'm so glad I got through it, you know, with my little sore throat. Please forgive me if, you know, if I do sound a bit hoarse, but like I said at the beginning of the video, I lost my voice a few days ago and yeah, it's coming back slowly but surely. So I'm trying to talk low, um, not trying to sort of like over exhaust my, my, my vocals. Um, but yeah, I'm absolutely fine as you can see. Okay, so thanks so much for watching. Do let me know which was your favorite item from today's haul. I think I've told you already which one was mine. Mine has to be for sure, oh my goodness, I do have a quite a few actually. Mine has to be for sure this wicker tray, this glass jar, and also this. <laughs> yeah, so do let me know which was yours, okay? So thanks so much for watching. If you are new, I'd love for you to stick around and hit the subscribe button. If you're returning, thank you so much for clicking on today's video. I appreciate every single one of you. Take care, keep well, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.